Hey everybody, it's Rebecca. Today, I'm calling this the Mandy Manzano Day. Yes, more Diamond Art Club. So come with me on this journey and let's take a look. Hi everybody, it's Rebecca, welcome back. Today is a continuation of my series this week of unboxing Diamond Art Clubs from the sale last weekend. And I'm hoping that you are enjoying this as much as I am because I just adore these canvases and I wish I could work on every single one of them next. Um, but I promise you I will get to them. So large, small, large, small, which one I think, let's go large because I'm very excited about this one. I'm excited about all of them really. My goodness. So this one is Who You Say I Am. And it is a Mandy Manzano 47 by 68 round with AB diamonds. Ooh, this is going to be nice. All right, let's get into it. We are taking off the plastic. I don't think I thought this painting was quite as big as it is. I really thought it was a smaller painting. But, you know, I guess I should pay more attention to sizes when I order stuff. All right, so, good news. Clear cover. So, we have some hope of a possible sticker or inventory sheet. The diamonds actually say, have the name of the painting, which is nice because invariably I cannot get them back in these packages correctly, so they'll never go back in the box. So I do have a place for all of my extra drills, but I, they either have to have the kit number on them or the name of the painting. So we will look at those after we look at the canvas, and we should have a toolkit. Yes, we do. So this is a round toolkit, um, just like the uh, other dozen you've seen this week, or half dozen. Two heart waxes, a three-placer, a pen, squishy, and a boat with a funnel. So we have the canvas, let's take a look. I will roll it backwards off camera, so you're not gonna see anything for a couple of seconds. I saw this uh, someone just finished this, and I thought that it was really, really pretty. So, um, so I had to include it on my order. Okay, so it comes with the famous diamond painting instructions, which I've gone over several times, and no inventory sheet. Boy, Friday's gonna be a doozy of a day when I haul these diamond paintings to work to make photocopies of the schematic, which I'm showing you here. You can see the symbols, the schematic. It is 35 colors. Now, you've got a lot of muted colors in this. Yellows, oranges, blues, grays but it does kit up really pretty. It, I've seen it done and it is really stunning. So here is the entire piece. I hope that is in the camera, oh, that you're getting the whole thing. You're getting pretty much all of it. Oh, it looks way better on camera too. Oh my gosh, look at this. I'm gonna put it sideways, I think. I love the color of her dress. I'm assuming she's wearing a dress. I think she's holding some doves, I believe. I could be wrong. And she's being nestled in these gorgeous hands in the clouds. It's so beautiful. And you can interpret it any way you want. I am not a religious person, so I don't give it a religious interpretation. Um, I'm more of a spiritual person in this still speaks to me um, in that, you know, you're in the hands of God, you know, when you're going through life. It's beautiful. Look at the flowers. Wow. 
and it is sticky. Gorgeous. Let me show you the drill field. Sometimes my camera does not want to focus, but we'll see. I'm going to hold it there for a second. And then we're going to look at the diamonds. And I do apologize. I am going to crinkle the package at this point. For those of you who love it, let's rock. Oh, white ABs. Lovely. Yeah, so it looks like there is the white AB and... Yeah, that's that's it for this painting. We're going to have white ABs. And let's see where they're at. They are here in the doves that she's holding are white ABs. All of this cloud area that you're seeing up here is white ABs. This area is white. This area is white ABs. This area, the outline of this palm is white ABs. The fingers, so that's a substantial amount of AB diamonds. So nice. These, I consider these sort of fall colors. So let's go through. Well, we can get the AB first. Why not? So there is a dark, dark gray here. There's your ABs. Absolutely gorgeous. 939, which is dark blue, 645. Oh, there's our dark brown. More dark, dark brown. 648, 300. Wow, okay. Now let's look at the next one. This is the largest amount of the diamonds. Okay, it's Mandy Manzano. So you do expect quite a lot of 310 because she has a lot of outlining that she does in her work, in her paintings. So everything will be outlined in the 310. So you have the three packages of that. Then you've got this 3855 color, which is gorgeous. And I suspect is some of this here that you're seeing in the hands. Let me just check. Yes. Yes, no. 38.55, yeah. Okay, so right underneath the white ABs, wherever you're seeing the white ABs, this color is going to be underneath them or nearby them then you're going to have the 3770 where is that okay that is so wow okay am i miss, missing symbols i all right i completely misinformed you so this all these dots that we're seeing is this color here i thought it was the white ab so all up in the clouds here is this color here. And I'm not sure what you would call, call that color, um, but it's beautiful. So where are the ABs, you ask? Rebecca, you told us there were a lot of white ABs. Okay, here they are, right in here. They're right underneath here. So they're following this black outline in the painting all around the sky, all around these curly cues, you're seeing the white AB. This is gonna be a gorgeous painting. And then you've got 976 orange and two bags of 3854, which is some more of this, um, let's see, yeah, this, this stuff that's in the palms. So you're gonna have, first you're gonna have in these palms, you're going to have this color here, this color here, and this color here of the, these three colors in the, the palms up here. That's going to be beautiful. 
Now I will show you the accents here. Probably what goes on her dress. 3853, 948, 754. There we go. We're starting into the dress here, the blues. 3760. And we got some green in there. Where's green? Oh, we got some green down here in the palms. Dripping out of his palms. Down here towards the bottom of the painting are some leaves to the flora in this painting. So we got blue, sort of a olive color perhaps there, a burnt orange, oh another pretty blue, there's that wine color, green, neutrals, a lot of neutrals here, huh? 823 and 647, that's a pretty color. That's a Probably a lot in here, imagine, I imagine here, yeah. 647, uh, yeah, absolutely, that's that's in here, right in here. These are nice, nice colors. Okay, that is this painting. I am going to wrap all this up off camera and come back with the next painting. Okay, I am back and with another diamond art club and which one is it it's a smaller one obviously it is the tower round with ab's 42 by 48 and i will tell you why i got this years ago probably about 20 years ago someone convinced me to read the dark tower series by stephen king so I did, and I loved it. And I'll tell you what, it's a fantasy series. And it, this painting really reminds me of that um, series of books. Stephen King never wrote another book in that same genre. And I don't read any of Stephen King's other books. I'm just not a fan, but I did enjoy the Dark Tower series, and I believe they even made a movie with my guy, Edra Albus, Edris Alba. Oh, man, I'm swooning. Um, he was in that, but I haven't seen that movie yet. I'm looking for it. It's not on Netflix. Um, okay, I, dig I digress. Let's get to the painting. I will find that movie, and I will watch it. But I wanted to do this painting. Jennifer Roberts just finished it. She did a post review and I fell in love with it. So uh, I'm a, co a complete copycat. I get it. But look at these colors. We've got the, the browns, the, you know, every color of brown, orange, and pink. This is really cool. So again, it does give me the title on the drills, which I'm excited about. It says A, B, I don't see them, uh, they're not jumping out at me, but we'll find them. Okay, clear cover, do what makes you sparkle. I think what makes me sparkle is buying Diamond Art Club. I thought I probably had the most Diamond Art Clubs of anyone. And then I met someone in, during my live last week who has way more than me. So if you think I have a lot, I do not in comparison. So regular brown toolkit like we talked about about 10 minutes ago. So here we go. Let's open this baby up. Let's open it up. And I'm going to off camera roll it the other way. These are self flattening. Diamond Art Club uses this beautiful, soft cotton, uh, cottony feel with the serrated edges so it doesn't fray. But it also has the wonderful uh, side effect of just flattening out. If you leave it for, you know, five or ten minutes, uh, if you leave it alone, it will flatten itself. Oh my God. I can't even believe this. With our diamond painting instructions, I actually got a <laughs> scum 
static. Now this is, so there, apparently there was a period of time where Diamond Art Club was using these. And this gave us the, the ability to put these through our sticker maker to put on our storage containers, which I do like this. I'm, I'm really very, very appreciative. But then they stopped giving inventory. They, did, they stopped putting these in the kits. And then they went to giving us the stickers. But there is a period of time in between when they were giving us these and they were giving us the stickers where the kits have nothing in them. So it's a short period of time, but there are still quite a few kits um, from stuff that's relatively new that's been sitting on their shelf for a while and just recently released that does not have an inventory sheet or a sticker or a schematic. And you're sort of on your own and that's when you sneak into your job to use the color printer and you make a copy of the schematic on the printer and you bring it home and put it through the sticker maker. Look at this. Oh my God, look at all this pink. Oh, oh, I'm having like an asthma attack looking at all this pink. Oh, I love pink. You know how much I love pink. Look at all of that pink. Like I said, I saw Jennifer working this uh, J-Rob. I call her J-Rob now. It's beautiful, and there is your AB number one, and I'm not lying to you this time. This is all AB up in here. All You see all the ones up in there, and it's so clear. I think you can see it. Super, super clear. So it's got the one AB. I don't think it has any others. No. But really really pretty so the body of this person and i say person because it's sort of uh androgynous we don't know if this is a man or a woman and the tower is up here so it's not really the focus it's this man that's headed towards the tower it's got an umbrella it just to me reminded me of that whole stephen king dark tower series this is how it is going to turn out when it's done. It's beautiful. So you do see that tower off in the distance there. So I'm curious what color that is. Let's take a look. It's going to be $7.79. So let's open the drills. All right, we're going to do the crackling. Here we go, crackling. Okay. We're done. Almost. Almost. Okay, we're done. So let's look. Oh, let's take the peek. All right, so we know we've got a lot of 310. This is not a Mandy Manzano, and I apologize. I do not know the name of the artist. I will find out. It will be in the description. I promise you. Um, whoa. Am I am I looking at that right? Yeah, no, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Oh, there it is. There. Oh, for a second, I thought there was no 310. It's here. Two bags of it. All of this is 310 in here and some in this area of the brush. We've got the dark brown, two bags of the black, a darker brown, dark, dark, dark brown. Yeah, lots of dark browns, lots of variations of brown. That's awesome. Oh, I can't wait to get to the pink. Okay. Let's see the pink we got. Purple. So there is a little purple thrown in there up here in the sky. Some green. I don't know if you could see that. I don't know if that came on the camera. Up here in the corner in the sky, there's some of that 154. Just enough to give you some flavor of purple. There is, no, that's not the AB. We haven't gotten to the AB yet. They're faking us out. Hot pink, ooh, yeah. Oh yeah. Wine. That always makes me want to have a glass of wine. Little red wine, mm, yeah. Oh, this one too. <laughs> 
Okay, that's pretty. It's like a reddish color there. Ooh, peach. Pink AB, no way. I thought it was gonna be a white AB. It's pink. <gasps> yes, I love it. <laughs> I love that. Gorgeous. And look at this pink. 963. Oh. All right, pink is my absolute favorite color. And look at these pinks here. We got big old bags of pink going on here. Oh, 3733. And this poor guy is snuggled in between these two beautiful pinks. Look at this pink. Beautiful. 3326. Thrown in with some more browns. Another darker peach. Wow. Wow. And another variation on pink. Oh, I'm in heaven. I am in heaven. In fact, I'm going to go out on a limb and say when I finish Wonderland in my live series that I do on Saturday nights from 7 to 9 p.m. Central, this is going to be the next thing I do. Um, yeah. So you will get to see me working on this during my lives, um, probably in a couple of weeks. I've got about two more weeks to work on Wonderland. It's not something, what I do during my lives is I only, if it's designated for the lives, that is the only time I work on it. Um, a little bit of time before and after so I can finish up whatever area that I'm doing but then I put it aside and I just work it on work on it during the live. So I do have one or two more weeks to work on Wonderland. Then we're going to frame it and then we will start on the tower. So if you guys want to work with me, some people like to get the same canvas and we work along together. Order this tower. It is not the most expensive that Diamond Art Club has to offer. It's beautiful. It the colors are stunning, and we can all work on it together. I think that would be awesome. So I just wanted to see the tower here. What what did I say that was? That is the arrow going down, 779. Where is that? They don't put them in DMC order. You just kind of have to guess. Because it's all done, it's all done by weight. Your packaging. That's why you're seeing the colors. The, um, you'll, it'll go from the lightest weight of diamonds to the heaviest. So I'm looking for that particular color. Oh, here it is. Okay, so this color right here is the tower. That's cool. So in between all of that pink, you got that dark tower there. Ooh, yay. Okay, so guys, Thanks for coming on this journey with me. If you want to work on this with me during my live, you got plenty of time to order it, get it in. Uh, Diamond Art Club will deliver pretty promptly. They're in this country. So, um, and I'll send out some reminders as well. So if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. If you want to know when I have more content up, more Diamond Art Clubs coming your way, as well as some Star Wars. We got some new releases in Star Wars uh, coming down the pike. If you want to know when I have that content available, hit the bell and you will know. So thanks for coming on this journey with me, everybody. And I will see you in my next video.